are going to study chapter 6 that is family and festivals from class 2 NSO Science Olympiad Workbook 2023. So let's study. What would be the key topics from where the questions might come? Family and family members, traditions and custom of families, relations and responsibilities amongst family members, special occasions in the family, festivals and celebrations, important days in India, indoor and outdoor activities. So let's see how many kind of families are there. Broadly, it is divided into two types. One is nuclear family where only parents and their children live together in the same house. And the other one is joint family. We are grandparents, parents, siblings, brothers, sisters, uncles, aunts and cousins all live together in the same house. So basically two types, nuclear and joint family. Some kids live either with their father or their mother. It is called a single parent family. Okay, so let's see a basic family tree. So in a basic family tree, we have three layers. The first generation come on the top. That is our grandfather and grandmother. Then comes the second generation. That is father, mother, uncle and aunts. And then come third generation. That is us, right? Brother, me, cousins. So all those. So basically it is first generation, second generation, third generation. Which is broadly asked in class 2 questions. But there are many more generations also. For now, you need to understand first, second and third generation. Members of a family have a common name. That is their surname. You must be having, right? Just check what is your father's surname. Same would be your surname. Members of a family resemble each other and may have similar habits too. Because they have been living together, right? On special occasions and festivals, we meet other members of our extended family. Traditions and customs are passed on from one generation to another. We play many indoor and outdoor games like carom, ludo, football, etc. with family and friends. What are the key festivals? Festivals can be national also or religious. Let's first see what are the national festivals of India. They are celebrated by all Indians. We have three national festivals. So you need to really remember this one. First is Independence Day, second Republic Day and third is Gandhi Jayanti. Then comes your religious festival. They can be many. In our country, people follow different religions. So the festivals they celebrate are basically religious festivals like Diwali, Dashehra, Christmas, Kurpurab, Eid al-Fitr, Holi, etc. That is all from the theoretical portion for chapter 6. Now we are going to solve some questions. Question 1. Which option shows all the indoor activities? A. Ludo, Karam, Cycling. Now here one is outdoor, that is cycling. So this is not correct. B. Chess, table, tennis, cricket. Again, we have outdoor activity that is cricket. It is also not correct. Football, watching TV, dancing. Here also football is out, outdoor activity. So it is not the correct option. Karam, chess, table, tennis. Now these three all are indoor activities. Indoor activities are those activities that are played or done inside the house. So this is the correct option. Option D. Question 2. The given picture shows which occasion being celebrated in the family. It looks like a birthday party. Option A, birthday celebration. Question 3. Which of the following is not a national holiday? So we talked about it, right? There are three national holidays. Independence Day, Republic Day and Gandhi Jayanti. Let's see. 15th August is Independence Day. 26th January is Republic Day. 2nd October is Gandhi Jayanti. But... 14 November is not a national holiday. It's Children's Day, but not a national holiday. So option D is the right answer for us. Question 4. What is the name of the Samadhi of our Rashtrapita? Okay, now let's see which one is the right option. So our Rashtrapita Mahatma Gandhi Samadhi is known as Rajghat. Option A. Question 5. On which did the Prime Minister of India hoist the national flag at the Red Fort in Delhi? The right answer here is option C, Independence Day. You must have watched on television or live at Delhi also, right? So 
तो फिफ्टींथ ऑगस्ट इज सेलिब्रेटेड एज ए इंडिपेंडेंस डे इन इंडिया ऑन दिस डे प्राइम मिनिस्टर ऑफ इंडिया हॉएस्ट द नेशनल फ्लैग एट द रेड फोर्ट इन डेली क्वेश्चन सिक्स पवन इज मैरिड टू वानी वानी इज डैश ऑफ पवन When two people marry each other, they are called married couple, and the female is called wife, while the male is called husband. So here, who is female? Vani. Vani would be called wife of Pawan. Option B is the right answer. Question seven. Select the odd one out among the following: Ludo, Carrom, Chess, and Hockey. So easy. Ludo, Carrom, and Chess are indoor games, and Hockey is outdoor game. So option D is the right answer. Question eight. Janagana Mani is R. It is our national anthem. Option B is the right answer. Question nine: Which of the following statements is incorrect about the harvest festivals? Okay, A. People of Punjab celebrate Baisakhi as their harvest festival. Absolutely correct. B. Rongali and Bhogali are the types of Bihu festival. Absolutely correct. C. Onam is celebrated in Kerala for ten days in the month of January. Now this is incorrect because Onam. Celebrated in Kerala for 10 days in the months of August and September, not January. So we have got our incorrect answer. That is option C. Which of these shows your contribution as a helping hand in your family? Okay, A, B, and C. So here, A is something helping out in the chores, right? Because we are watering the plant. so that is helping in the family b is we are having dinner we are obeying we are helping so b is also correct now c is helping our elders that is also correct right option is option d all of these question 11 match column 1 with column 2 and select the correct option column 1 a dr s radhakrishnan it will match 4 that is teachers day B Mahatma Gandhi it is going to match Martyrs Day B3 Jawaharlal Nehru will match Children's Day C1 and Sardar Vallabh Bhai Patel will match Unity Day D2 so the right answer here is option D A4 B3 C1 and D2 Mr X wears turban and is follower of Guru Nanak Dev he goes to dash to offer prayers so let's identify Mr X first Mr X is a Sikh Sikh wears turban and follow Guru Nanak Dev, and Sikhs go to Gurudwara. Which one of these is a Gurudwara? It's option A, Golden Temple. Question thirteen. Rohan made four groups, each with two activities of similar kind, but he made one mistake while pairing activities in one of the groups. Select the incorrect group. Okay, now let's see. A, Ludo and Karam. This is correct. Both are indoor. and uh, now coming to table tennis and polo oh now here table tennis is indoor while polo is an outdoor game this is incorrect incorrect is option b question 14 refer to the given conversation among four people and find out the one who is correct a amit rishi is my niece he is the only son of my sister oh oh that's wrong because son of sister is called nephew not niece Okay, so that is wrong. B. So hell, I love talking to my aunt, Mrs. Sharma. She is the sister of my grandmother. No, because grandmother's sister is also called grandmother. C. Arushi, my daughter has a cousin who is the son of my uncle. That is incorrect because son of mother's uncle is uncle, not cousin. D. Ria, my friend has sisters only. Thus, his children do not have any real uncle. That's correct. because they will have only aunt so option d is the right option for us question 15 identify the festival being celebrated in the given picture and select the option which correctly tells how people celebrate this festival now the picture here is of eid festival it is celebrated by muslims and special prayers are offered in mosque on this day and they wear new clothes and eat meethi sewaiyan now let's see the options a they decorate trees with sweets and toys no that's christmas b they go to the mosque to offer prayers and eat meethi sewaiya yes that's correct that is what happens in uh, the festival eid option b is the right answer achievers section hots question 16 the effigies of two persons are burned every year along with ravana on dashera who are those two persons and what are their relations with ravana 
you must have seen burning of ravana on dashara right but do you know who are those two people it is option a kumbhakaran ravana's brother and meghnath ravana's son question 17 seema is daughter in law of amit okay sunil is the brother of seema's husband so who is seema's husband seema's husband and sunil they are brothers and they both are son of amit so how is sunil related to amit sunil is amit's son option a is the right answer question 18 study the given family tree and select the correct option regarding it okay so we have kartik and bini and they have uh, children rakesh sudesh shweta shweta is married to rohan and have kavya and gini as children and rakesh is married to reema and have rashmi and sohan as children okay so let's see rakesh and sudesh are cousins no rakesh and sudesh they both are sibling because they have same parents okay so this is incorrect ginni is sudesh's aunt is it no ginni is sudesh's niece this is incorrect see kavya is rakesh's niece now this is correct why because as rakesh and shweta are sibling therefore kavya who is daughter of shweta would be rakesh's niece so we got our correct answer that is option c question 19 study the given family tree of sanvi and select the correct option regarding it okay it's a three generation family tree a sanvi has two cousins no it's it's not like that because from the family tree you can see in the third generation there is only one cousin sister of sanvi rest are siblings one brother and two sisters are siblings so this is incorrect b sanvi has two brothers and one sister no we already saw that it is two sisters and one brother then c among the two aunts of sanvi only one is married absolutely correct you can see the one uh, who is in the extreme left she is married and the one who is in the middle is unmarried so option c is the correct answer for us question 20 refer to the given word chop table and find out the boxes which give name of the festival that marks birthday of jesus christ and that is christmas let's see it will be 9 7 and 10 so which option has 9 7 10 as a option b let's see the b name of the festival of colors it's holy and 2 and uh, 12 will give us holy so you can see in option b a is 9 7 10 and b is 2 12 so this is the correct option for us with this we have studied chapter 6 for uh, class 2 nsu workbook 2023 do like the video and subscribe the channel if you have not yet done explore the playlist which are there in the channel they have so many olympiad papers and other educational material we'll be uploading remaining chapters also very soon so stay active on the channel and keep watching bye bye